Hi, my name is Jen Atkinson. I'm an occupational therapist with Five Minds Mobility. I'm here today to explain the Align 360, which is a foam replacement hospital bed mattress. What I really want to show you today is the difference between this mattress and any other surface on the market. Um, really, uh, what makes it unique and different is something called shear reduction technology. And really what we need to do is look to the inside of the surface. So I'm going to come around. What you're going to see actually with this mattress is something um, between the surfaces. So what we have is two layers of low friction material. The low friction material separates a topper where a client can immerse to address pressure issues um, on a firm foam base. What happens is when the head of the bed comes up, the top surface moves in relation to the bottom surface. So shear is absorbed within the mattress itself instead of in the client's skin. So that's clinically significant. If we can reduce that shearing factor, which we know uh, contributes greatly to wounds, um, then that is something that, uh, as a therapist, is exciting to me. Um, when the head of the bed comes up, it's like a rowing machine. So it's when the client's sitting on a seat of a rowing machine and the rowing machine moves, the mechanism underneath does not move. That's the same kind of concept with this. When the head of the bed comes up, the top surface moves in relation to the bottom surface. The other unique thing about this mattress is that because it's glued at the, porsche, at the bottom portion and glued at the top portion, this foam topper recenters itself when the head of the bed comes back down. And that again is clinically significant because it does address the need to, the, the need to reposition a client. Um, the client creeps down the bed, as a client would do in any foam replacement mattress. But when the head of the bed comes back down, the unique part is that topper replaces itself on the, on the base, which means the client actually ends up in the same spot that they were when the head of the bed came up in the first place. That is a really clinically significant thing to me as well, um, because we're addressing shear on the way up, we're addressing shear on the way down, and then we're reducing the need for a client to be repositioned back up in bed um, again, thereby reducing shear. Um, and also caregiver hours having to reposition a client back up in bed. Really the wow factor is in the demo, so I'd like to show you and actually have the head of the bed come up and down. Okay. So what I'd like you to do is take note of where my feet are on the logo. So when the head of bed comes up, I'm going to be creeping down the bed. You can see that I'm moving down the bed, which is a normal repositioning issue on a foam replacement mattress. So I've creeped down oh, about two, two and a half inches. What normally happens now, though, on a foam replacement mattress is that when the head of the bed comes back down, I would stay down there. But because of the design of this surface, when the head of the bed comes back down, you're going to see that I'm going to come back up with it because that foam is actually moving on the firm foam base. So the head of the bed has come all the way back down, and you can see that I've ended up in the same spot as when the head of the bed came up in the first place. So again, that is a clinically significant factor um, that makes it different from any other um, any other surface on the market. We do address pressure by having those relief cuts that you saw in the uh, foot of the bed in two by two sections, and in four by fours in the torso. The firm foam uh, bolsters make it easier for transfer and these unique accordion cuts make it easier for the head of the bed to come up and down and the foot of the bed to come up and down without the, the uh, mattress popping out of the bed frame. So that allows us to make a really firm uh, bolster at the side which is easier for transfers and then the center is cut higher so that you're not stuck behind a firm foam bolster. So that really there's a lot of clinical uh, design uh, behind this mattress. If you have questions um, please feel free to visit our website at uh, www. 5mindsmobility.com um, and I'd be happy to answer any questions that you have.